Now you should study this video in loads of detail. We could talk over the top of it and point all the little bits out, but the best way to, for you to learn from these videos is to watch them over and over and over again and pick out those real key points for the helm and crew. So we'll play it through in slow-mo once and pick out a couple of them, but you need to go through it yourself with a little notepad. And if you're a crew, pick out what Ben's doing. If you're a helm, pick out what Mimi's doing. So let's play it in slow-mo. Key points. The first key thing for the helm is to swap the main sheet over the top of the tiller. So Mimi's just done that there. That means that when you start the turn, the main sheet's not in the way. The next key thing is to have consistent communication. So ready to jibe, crew says ready, helm says let's go. You need that every single time. The next thing is when to start the turn. So you should start the turn when the crew starts to move. So as a helm, you need to have an eye, an eye on the crew's front hand. When their front hand hits the handle, start the turn, tiller over to the new side, turn consistently, confidently pull the boom over, and sit down. Let's just play that again in slow motion. Swap your hands on the tiller, Clear communication, start the turn, consistent turn speed, and confidently pull the boom over. Do those things and you'll be pretty sorted. All the other detail of footwork and timing is something that you're going to have to work out for yourself and what works best for you. You can use this video as a pretty good resource to help you do that. Let's speed along to the next jibe. And take a look at the helm again. So, they do jibe eventually. So swap, hat, swap the main sheet over the tiller, clear communication, start the turn when the crew starts to move, consistent turn and confidently pull the boom over. Now the way to judge how consistent your turn is, one method is to look through the end of the pole and if the pole is moving nice and consistently over the landscape in front of you, that's a pretty good judge. If it's jerking around, then you're not turning very consistently. So let's have a look at the crew. Clear communications come from the helm. Confidently stands up. Move your hand down the old sheet. Pull the old sheet on. Then grab a new sheet. And as soon as you've got hold of a new sheet, start running for that wire. So as a crew, the key things are moving nice and consistently and smoothly on the entry and pulling the old sheet on. If you do those two things, not much can go wrong. Let's speed along a little bit here. Confidently stands up, walks down the old sheet, pulls it on nice and tight, grabs the new sheet and runs for the wire. If your kite's constantly getting twisted when you jibe, it's because you haven't pulled the old sheet on enough. If you pull the old sheet on nice and tight, and you can even give it a little pull at the end, then the kite should blow through past the jib without too much issue. Now you want to grab the new sheet just before the boom comes over. Stand up confidently, down the old sheet, give a little pull, grab the new one and run. 